Hello, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Linux Game World. This time, we're going to be taking a look at Destination Sol. It's a game that's available for free on Steam for Linux, and this time we're going to be doing um, a Let's Play. I've never played this before. This is the first time I've ever even started the game. And I thought it'd be uh, fun to do a little Let's Play series on this this time all i know about it is it's a space based 2d game so let's take a look now this is supposed to be an open world i do believe a large open space world it seems that w at the moment is the only movement key that matters the uh, a s and d do Nothing. I'm guessing this is the sort of game you would have to put a lot of time into to learn and get used to. I think our guns are longer range than theirs. And they popped into rocks. Because that's what spaceships do, don't they? When they blow up, they turn into a pile of rocks. The modern alchemy. More money. Let's go back to the space station. Too bad there isn't uh, a mini-map on the screen at all times. Perhaps that's an upgrade that you can buy at some point. But here is our space station, our friendly craft. All right, that's, that's right. To get to the Starship menu, you have to talk to them, not just look at your items. Okay, buy. Blaster, small shield, light armor. Machine gun bullets, medium armor. And I see we have a hundred space bucks. Heavy machine gun, missiles, etc., etc. I believe we're using a blaster now. Let's let's see what it is we're using now. Yes, we're using a blaster. Can we get some information on it? Damage 4.8 a second. That's a number. So. Let's see. Machine gun, 6.1 a second, although you have to use bullets with it. Maybe if we get close, can we talk to them? Can you want to talk? Want to talk? Nope. Guess you don't want to talk, do you, buddy? It looks like we did get some loot, some fat loot. We got a, a pirate plasma gun. Ooh, plasma cells for the pirate plasma gun. Slow mo charge. Use on ships with slow mo ability. So, 4.8 a second, 2.3 a second. I guess that's the sort of thing we will want to, uh, Go back to the base and sell. More fat loots. Do you know that uh, back in the uh, days, the heyday of, of EverQuest 1, there was an Easter egg in the game where if you went to a certain part of the game and talked to a certain character and said fat loot... You got something for it. I can't remember. If you're interested in the details, I'm sure you can Google it. For the knowledge of Google knows all. I suppose getting money from asteroids is sort of a uh, direct correlation to mining them. You're just kind of skipping the gathering and selling stage. And just getting the money from within their sweet rocky bosom. 
Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's acrobatic. Suppose we should take a look at where we are. Okay, there's a pirate planet. I know it said not to go towards the pirate planets, but I'm going to anyhow. Let us see what is there. And I'm guessing these dots along the edge of the screen show us where there's a gravitational field. Oh. Okay. Planet now. Whoop. Whoop. Hey, look, it's a planet. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know if we're having much effect against up oh, dangerous enemy. Oh crap. Oh boy. And right now, I'm having to play against the gravity of the planet. Oh goody, two of them. Uh, a bomber and, and a... Look, it's grass!